we go home. People want to know. People want to know. Who we all have. Who we all have. So we tell them. So we tell them. Good night. Hi, I'm Jackie Mori. I'm a nationally recognized customer loyalty strategist, published author, and founder and CEO of Customer Strategy Academy. We are on the final stretch and my favorite part of boot camp. As I've mentioned yesterday in my Kindle ebook entitled Customer Loyalty 101, I talk about three lost keys that companies and small businesses must acquire and use to their advantage to build customer loyalty. Then, in my online video training course called Customer Loyalty Blueprint, I do a deep dive into these three keys. Today, we are going to finish up on this first lost key, which is hospitality. Yesterday, we discussed that hospitality means being welcoming, generous, and friendly. When my husband and I invite guests over to our home, we do our best to practice hospitality. We have a welcome mat at our front door. We welcome our visitors by greeting them with open arms and a warm smile. And we make them feel at home. We prepare more than enough food and drink and express our generosity toward them. What we want most is for them to have the most enjoyable and fun time at our home. Wouldn't you do the same? Of course you would. Well. This same kind of setting or environment needs to be what your clients and customers experience at your company, at your office, and at every connection point. Here's a game-changing idea for you. Are you ready? Here it is. Start viewing your customers, clients, members, or patients as your guests. Yes, your guests. This one strategic idea changes the entire outlook of how your team views or looks at your customers. Because once your team sees and relates to your clients, members, or patients as guests, the way they'll welcome them, the way they'll talk with them on the phone, the way they'll converse face-to-face -face with them as guests will be completely different than if your team merely viewed them as just another customer. Okay, we've now established that offices, small businesses and professional practices must begin treating clients as guests. Yet what do most companies have right by their door? A welcome mat? Guess again. They have a no soliciting sign. Now do you think that stops solicitors? No, not at all. So what's the point of making 99% of the people who walk through your door, your customers, feel a bit unwelcome? by that no soliciting sign. Now let's talk about the word friendly. Allow me to ask you, are you friendly? Is your staff friendly? On a scale of one to 10, how friendly are you? If you and your staff are a consistent nine or 10, then your likelihood of developing loyal customers is extremely high. Congratulations. Now, if you have a grump or a couple of them who work at your practice or in your business, train them in consistent, friendliness and hospitality. And then if you've done everything you could possibly do to help them and all else fails, move them elsewhere and replace them with happy and friendly people. Well, thanks so much for watching today's Customer Loyalty Bootcamp video. We are fast tracking through my favorite part of Bootcamp where I give you the three lost keys that companies and small businesses must use to their advantage to build customer loyalty. I'm Jackie Mori. I want to help you become world-class. I look forward to connecting with you soon.